history, but when we get to know it, it becomes much more comfortable. Example, when I'm in Eastern Turkey, I love to find a whirling dervish and introduce him to my travelers. You know those guys that whirl and get all dizzy, kind of cruise ship entertainment? Well, here's, I'll just paraphrase this. It wasn't exactly these words, but essentially this. I'm with my group, 20 people, in Turkey. I find a dervish and I say, hi, I'm an American tour guide. I've got 20 tourists. We'd love to watch you whirl. He says, I'm not a photo op, I'm a monk. And that's when I'm praying. I'll let you watch me whirl if I can explain to you what I'm doing. I said, great. So we met him, he was dressed up in his outfit. He said, I am a dervish. That's the Muslim equivalent of what you would call a monk. I follow a prophet or a poet, a great philosopher named Mevlana. You think of him maybe as Rumi. He's kind of like the St. Francis for us Muslims. You know, the prophet of love, you can get your brain around what everybody likes him. Five times a day, as a dervish, I get myself into a meditative trance. I plant one foot in my community, my hometown, my family. The other foot goes around acknowledging the diversity of God's great creation. One hand goes up, accepting the love of our Maker, and the other hand goes down, like the spout on a tea kettle, showering God's love on His creation. And five times a day I lose myself in that idea, and I become a conduit of God's love, living that out here in His creation. As a teacher, as a tour guide, watching my students, I saw the wonder sweeping over their faces. Suddenly this guy was a little less scary, a little less freaky, and a little more understandable. And when you come home with that, you take with you what I think is the greatest souvenir, and that is a broader perspective. When we think of how we're going to grapple with this globalized society, we know we need to be globally competent. And it's important to have our language efficiency, and it is important to have our global outlook. And when we put that together, I believe we are really creating a younger generation more able to deal with the exciting future that we're facing. Thank you so much. It's been a thrill to be here. Thank you for